let's say that a small business owner wants to or needs to take out a loan for growth or development or a startup or whatever, what should he or she consider in terms of deciding on whether to get a short-term or a long-term loan? Okay. Back to what we were talking about earlier, I'm going to use that buzzword of the matching principle again. What we need to determine is what the reason for the loan is and realistically what people will come in and talk about is, well, I need to borrow this much money to do this and, and when we really dig into it, we might find out that what they really need is a loan that, that's really a whole different direction. Um, frequently, a, a real good example is, I need a line of credit to fund my company. Okay, well, what what we might do is maybe we set up a $25,000 line of credit, but the line of credit should be paid back with operations from the company as mm -hmm. accounts receivable come in or as products are sold, the line of credit gets paid down. Well, frequently companies are fairly undercapitalized when they start. So um, what that $25,000 line of credit really might need to be is a $25,000 capital injection that they don't have to pay back in 30 days or 60 days but they have a chance to pay back in two, three, four years at $700 a month instead of three or $4,000 at a clip. Um, mm -hmm. And that's where we try to sit with and, and find out what's the company really needing. Not what they're asking for, but what do they really need. So you can be a great resource for a new or inexperienced business owner. They might know what they want, but you could tell them what they really need. Gosh, I'd like to think I am.